Hey, what's up, y'all? It's John O. What's up? And it's Shella G. And we are back. This is actually our second vlog video. It is. For our channel. And this time, we're coming to you live from an undisclosed location. Ooh. Ooh. But we're here to talk about things that annoy us on social media. Whether it's Facebook, whether it's Instagram, social media, period. So, without any further delay, Yoshelle, let's jump right into it. Okay, first first thing on my list, we were talking about this earlier, is the friend stealer. Psst. Yes. <laughs> now, if you don't know what the friend stealer is, anybody that's been on Facebook knows that you have friends on Facebook. You have friends. IG. Me, me, and, you, me and you share friends. We, are, we do. We share friends. And, and it, it wouldn't work so much with me and you, but it's usually with guys. I'm going to go ahead and say it. Oh. Fellas. It's fellas. Fellas will go on your page. You ever go You ever go to somebody's page and you like a, a photo and then you look down and you notice somebody that doesn't know that person has liked that picture. But you know mm -hmm. the only common thread these two people have is you. Is you. Is you. You're like, I know you don't know. I know that he don't know her. So why is he liking her photos? That, oh, wait a minute. Let me look. Mutual friends. How are they mutual friends? How did that? That's the friend stealer. When they go in your friends list, see pretty pictures of pretty guys or pretty girls, and they like all and they and they, and they request them to become <laughs> friends. Why do people do that? Shady. It's very shady. It's like get your own friends. Get, get your own friends. Don't steal my friends. Leave, leave. If I want you to meet my friends, I'll I'll e introduce you. Okay. I'll, Ooh, I'll, I like that. You e, e introduce. E introduce. Okay. Electronic. Yes. Introduce. That's right. That's God, right. I think you need to pat that. No, that, it, it's been so, used. So, damn it. Okay, yeah. all right. Well, what's the next one? You over the age of 25, you should not be making silent movies, as I like to call them. <laughs> you are not Charlie Chaplin. Don't take silent videos and post them of you just staring into the camera or staring into the mirror. And it's video. Like, take a photo. Just take a still photo. Don't stand there for a whole minute looking into the camera as if to say I am so fine that I I know that you want to look at me for over a minute or so maybe I I, I, I hate that I hate that I hate that I, I I especially hate it when they add the music to it to try to make it dramatic oh uh, what is it look so many people out there want to be actors true <laughs> they want to be actors so bad <laughs> so this is their chance this is their I would say 15 minutes of fame, but it's not even that. It's it's 60 seconds of but fame. But are they acting? Like, is it they're that acting they like be... a damn fool by yeah. standing in front of the camera by saying nothing. Or, or being in the gym. When they're in the gym and they're just standing there, full face makeup, or, or even dudes too. It's not just women. No, Men too, standing there, flexing, you're in the mirror. But I thought you are supposed to be there working out. You are. So why are you standing taking silent, silent movies, <laughs> Charlie Chaplin? Silent movies hey, with your cell phone. It's I, weird. Listen, I have it's been, I, I will say this. I have been guilty of taking a photo of myself in the gym. I've took, I've you took have. a photo. Yes, I have. And I laughed. Oh, okay. And that's, okay. that's cool. I've even did videos of me working out in the gym. But that's different. Okay. Yeah, and I was about to say that. I do the photos because I want the before and the after. Right. That's what, it's not like I'm there posing and trying to do a photo shoot. Yes. I'm just there, all right, so let me see my progress of what's going on yes. with the body. And I get that. I so, get that people who are doing it because they're either trainers or they're, you know, they're training, they're training someone or they're just, they want to see their progress or they want their friends to say, hey, you know what? You you can do you can do it too. Look at what I'm doing. They want to be encouraging. I'm not talking about those people. Right. You just talking about the people that stand there and, and lick their lips and stick their tongue out. Uh, oh, did you hear what tongue? That stick their tongue out. Yeah. yeah. I don't understand that. If you're over 25, <laughs> you should not be doing that. Yes, and that is our. <laughs> Hey, these views are only views expressed by Shella and John. Uh, All right, let's go with the next one, girl. Let's go with the next one. People taking pictures or videos in their house, whether it's bathroom, their bedroom, whatever. I know where you're going. Where? I know where you're going. Where? This where? Is, listen, listen. There have been tons of pretty girls who I see shooting videos or taking pictures on IG or on Facebook. 
And then when you look around in the background, mm. it's filthy as hell. Filthy. Why would you take photos when you are standing there looking all about to go out? You looking all glamorous or sexy or handsome. And in the background, your bed's not made. There's there's dishes in the sink. You in the kitchen or you in the bathroom and your bathroom is dirty. Why would you do that? There's no reason for you nasty people to be doing that. We see you. We see you. We d crop all of that out or clean it up. That's it. I mean, it's, it's there's got to be a bare wall somewhere in your house. In your house. Somewhere that, that there's nothing. First of all, first of all, I have a complaint with people who take pictures in the mirror anyway. I I I, I, weird. I think that's extremely weird to me for you to be in a bathroom mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then take the camera, place it to the mirror, yeah, and take a picture of yourself. Is it because they need a full shot and they, if they need it, you know what? They should get a tripod. You get a tripod. Invest in a tripod. Then you don't have to do that. Invest in one of them hole sticks. Them, 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 a them, selfie a stick. A selfie stick. Yeah. It's That's just, good. it's just, I, I don't get it. I don't get it. And I really hate it when I see dudes doing it. But, yo, clean your house. Clean your kitchen and stop taking pictures of yourself looking glamorous with, excuse my French, because we're trying to keep this PG. Yeah. Shitty backgrounds. Oh! Ooh. I'm just saying. Next one. Oh, okay. And I've seen this happen on your page. Uh -oh. I, have, uh -oh. Oh, I have seen you and Priest or having conversations uh -oh. about. Are we, are we talking about the hijacker? The, the hijacker. Yes. The hijacker. Oh. Have you ever been on Facebook and you've been in a deep conversation with a bunch of friends and it's the conversation is going long and it's really, really deep. And meaningful. <laughs> and then out of nowhere, you get this one stranger who comes along and he posts a flyer of his CD coming out next week. And you're like, what the? Is this? I hate when people try to hijack your thread, man, and talk weird. about something that has nothing to do with what you're talking about. No, it's weird. Somebody is going to look at this video because yeah. it's going to get a lot of views. And a lot of people going to be commenting on it. They're going to be mad. And then somebody's going to hijack it. And be like, That's what they're going to do? <laughs> they're going to do. They're going to be like, oh, yo, I got a party coming up. Uh, listen to my music. Listen to my music. My mixtape. Oh, yo, I got this movie dropping. It. Look, dude. When you're on, when you see a thread that's been talking about something that's important, continue with the conversation. Don't try to uh, uh, hijack that's what it is. You're the thread. It over. Yeah, don't try to hijack the thread with your promotions. And Stop a lot of times it. it's someone you don't even know. It's like... Oh, it's and you're always like, that. And you're like, how did they even get... Oh, okay, never mind. And then that's how... That person becomes the friend stealer because they actually see all these people. That's right. And they start stealing your they friends. They start stealing your friends. And okay, we got one more. We got one more. We got one more. All right, hit them with the last okay. one, Michelle. So, this is... When... See, I want everyone to win. I, I'm excited for everybody. I know. I'm serious. I love people. You know me. I love people. I'm a happy-go-lucky. I love everyone. I, I believe that, you know, I want to see everyone happy. So when you post something that's very, um, what's the word? It doesn't give any information. But you want people to know. I like to call this person the fisher. Da the, the fisher, fisher is, yeah. is the perfect thing like don't tell me hey it's about to happen uh, uh pray for me well, what's about to happen and so then you look up and there's a hundred people that have commented saying well what what's what's happening or well, what's going on is everything okay people are generally concerned because it's like family members and friends and it's like we're really concerned about what's going on with you is it good is it bad you know like let us know and it's like, I know you see, I know you see people commenting. So why don't you just answer back and tell everybody what it is? You know why? Why? Because they're fishing for compliments. That's what they do. Is doing. that it? They're fishing. They need validation. And they, they, that's what it is. They're fishing for compliments. They want people to constantly, uh, I don't want to say annoy, but uh, fish for what they're doing. Right. I, that's the best way I can say is the, the fishing. They're fishing for compliments and validation. And I think I think a lot of times today, a lot of people do that. Yeah. Uh, that that they do it. They do it uh, 
that way. They do it with the thirst trap. They do it with it, it's yes. just it's, it's just the silent video. The silent video. They it's look all together. For, it's all wrapped up in one, and it it's annoying. These are just things that annoy us. Yeah. With social media. It's true. It, yeah. So the so fishing, many more. Yeah, it's so many more. But we just wanted to give you five things that really annoy us on social media. Now we'd like for you to tell us if we didn't mention anything. What do you get annoyed about when you are on social media? Yeah, because I know I left something out. So oh, wait, I want to see what you guys have to say. Or let us know if we're crazy. Like, are we being too hard? Uh, like, are we? I don't know. Ah, but I'm right. saying, you know, someone may may come, have a different opinion about it and, and shed some light on it. May help me change my mind. If you do, hey, help yeah, me. Let, let help us know. me. But definitely leave a comment down below on anything that annoys you as far as social media is concerned. And before we go, we want to give an honorable mention to one thing. Oh, yes. What really big annoys both me and Shella, and I'm sure it it annoys tons of other Americans out there Everybody, right now. Right Not now. even Americans, but just the, People, world. the world. Just the world. the world. When the president is tweeting more than a 12-year-old girl, why is our president such a tweeter? Why? Why? We don't need you tweeting. We need you running the country. That's all we need him to do. That's all. Stop and, tweeting, man. And and he doesn't even... It's not even it, that he tweets as much as a 12-year-old girl. Like, a 12-year-old actually tweets better than him. Like, makes more sense. Oh, yes. That that I agree. I agree with you wholeheartedly on that one. Yeah. So, um, look. <sighs> we enjoyed this time with you, man. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you. Um, please continue to subscribe, like, share, comment on all of these videos that we put up, man. We have, again, we have tons of stuff coming, so just keep with us, man. Tell your friends to tell a friend to tell a friend. Yeah. Subscribe to S&J Productions, baby. Hang with us. That's right. Come come kick it with us. Yeah. Talk, you know, and, and, and anytime you feel like you want a topic that you want us to discuss, you can also leave that down and we'll check it out. If, it, if it's interesting enough for us to discuss, then maybe you'll see your topic right here on our channel. Right. right so you ready to be out? We gotta go. We gotta go. Till the next time. Till the next time, we'll see y'all later. Deuces.